Hi, this is problem 5 from the 2020 AIM-1. Six cards numbered 1 through 6 are to be lined up in a row. Find the number of arrangements of these six cards where one of the cards can be removed, leaving the remaining five cards in either ascending or descending order. Okay, so I didn't find a clever way to count this, so I had to bash this one out. Let's look at the ascending card order first. So just looking at the ascending, if the card we're going to remove is the card number one, then the possible arrangements are one, two, three, four, five, six. Move the one over. 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 Okay, so we have uh, six possible arrangements if we're going to remove the card number one. Okay, that wasn't too hard. Uh, let's see if we try to remove the card number two. Then two could be all the way to the left. Could be one over. One over. One over. One over. And one over. Okay, so we have some duplicates now that we have to uh, sort out. Uh, we have this, which we already counted, so let's make a little notation for that. Uh, we have uh, this, which we already counted, so let's make a little dot for that. All right, that's not too bad. Let's do the next three cases uh, in fast-forward mode. Okay, and finally, uh, case number six, six all the way to the left. Move the six over, over one, over one, over one. Finally, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we certainly counted that one many times. And we counted this one from the list above. Okay, so for the ascending order, the total number of arrangements is 6 plus 5 times 4. And if we repeat this process for the descending order, we'll basically have the exact identical process which will count these exact same number of items. So we'll just have to double this to get the number of arrangements for both ascending and descending. So that's uh, 2 times 26, or 52. Final answer.